also wanted to show you a matching envelope that I wanted to make for the baby boy card for my newborn nephew. And this is an A2 size envelope I'm going to be making with my Martha Stewart scoreboard. So I'm just going to take my little phone folder here and it gives you all the directions right here. Um, I don't know if you can see that. But it gives you, let's see if that'll clear it up. Mm, it's just horrible lighting. But it gives you all the directions here and it just ends up sliding right here in the down compartment. But um, for an A2 card, you start with an eight and a half by eight and a half paper. So here we are. What I did was it says if you want Uh, to make an envelope for cards that aren't very bulky to go down one eighth. So I actually did this at eight and three eighths or four eighths, excuse me. I can't count. No, that's three eighths. One, two, three. Three eighths. I can't count. Eight and three eighths by eight and three eighths. So here I line it up. There we are. And you score on the A's and then the B's. So on A2, I'm going to score at 3. So I come here at 3. And I make a line. Okay. I turn it completely right here. So my A line's here. And now I'm going to make another A line. And I score at 3. Okay. Then I turn it once. So now I'm at my B lines. Or excuse me. B lines here, but they now they're turned to the side, and I score at three and five eighths. So here's three, one, two, three, four, five eighths. So this green line, three and five eighths. I turn it here, so I have my A's done at three, and then my B at three and five eighths. Line it up, and I have my three, one, two, three, four, and five eighths of the green. Okay, so now we have, I don't know if you can see those score lines. I have one here, one here, one here, and here. So let me get this out of the way. Excuse me. Oh, excuse me. Oh, all those allergies in the air. Okay, let's scoot in just a little bit here. Okay, so I'm going to turn it over. And I am going to just... Put it down, lay it flat, and then on this side, just give it the good old bone folder, and just score it on all the sides, and reinforce those creases. Okay, so now we have this. Okay, so we're going to take our scissors, handy dandy sharp scissors. I really love these bees. Love them. They're super sharp. I have poked myself many a time. And I just, you cut out these little triangles here. And I don't know if y'all have been keeping up with what's been going on with like the new products that, like that have been rolling out like at the CHA. But they have, that I saw, this new memory keep, we are memory keepers envelope punch board. I am super excited about it because, I mean, not that this isn't fun, but to cut out these corners, but it's super easy. You just punch it out. Y'all need to go check it out. It's by We Are Memory Keepers Envelope Punch Envelope Board or something like that. But I'm super excited. You can make like over 60 different sizes of envelopes without all this, you know, flipping and turning and all that. It's just super easy. So from here, I'm just going to take my handy dandy just permanent glue stick here let's see if we can get that in focus maybe no it likes my hand to be in focus okay well it's just oh strong I can't open this I'm just gonna fold it up like this hello and make sure that can fold up nicely that can fold up nicely and I just go here and I go here 
And I like to use, let's see, right there. I like to use glue sticks when I'm making my envelopes. I just feel like, I don't know, I feel like they hold better. And then just kind of fold those up like that. Okay, so. And I'm going to take my corner chopper here. And it's, um, I don't know if you can see that, but it's, there's a quarter side and then there's an inch side. I'm just going to use, well, let's see what the quarter looks like and then we'll go from there. Um, yeah, that looks good to me. Just a little quarter. Just gives it a little bit of a, let me see if I, that's even straight. I'm so horrible at straightness. Yep, that's good. I, it was a little bit crooked. So, there, and then we're just going to reinforce the edges again, and then there we are. This card's just going to go in there, and it just looks super duper cute, and I hope my sister-in-law likes it. If I can put it in the envelope. And there we are for the little baby. So, thanks so much for watching again, and um... Thanks so much. Have a great one. Bye-bye.